Hello, I'm going to be giving a brief tutorial on how to properly set up HLSW to use with a Gary's Mod server. So the first thing you want to do is once you've installed it, you'll launch it. I always launch as administrator, but I don't think it particularly matters. So the next screen that's going to pop up is a login screen. You don't need to log in to use HLSW, so just click offline. And then you should see a screen that looks something like this. You can customize the different fields. Um, the particular setup that I like is the ping meter on the left followed by the user list and the server list up top. So what you're going to want to do is go into the IP port and choose uh, from the game list you're going to want to choose Half-Life 2 because Gary's Mod is a Half-Life 2 mod and then in the box right next to that you're going to want to type in your server IP so the one we're going to use is 216.245.209.8.0 port number so your colon and then the port number so 27018 for my server and if you typed it in properly it should autofill everything else you'll see your server in the list the number of players and the ping to your server basically everything that's public information about the server so this is at this point you you can actually see information um, you can't send commands or anything but you can monitor a server you know see if it's online what the ping is, who all is on the server, but if you want to be able to send and receive chat and commands, which is pretty much what HLSW is, is for, you're going to need to type in your Archon password. So at the bottom screen of the screen, you're going to see different tabs. If you want to type in or go to the Archon tab, Archon, Archon config tab, and type in your Archon password. So I'm going to click the hide box so that way you guys don't see my password. But uh, also make sure you click save, otherwise every time you launch HLSW you're going to have to retype in the password, unless that's what you want. So my password and then you can click test to make sure that it works and then click get log and then a little notification should pop up on your screen you don't see it because it's on my other monitor but it should say successfully receiving server log at that point then now you'll see um, pretty much the server log will stream to your HLSW and you can type commands and actually get responses back from the server. Also, you'll be able to send and receive chat to and from the server. It's kind of slow on my server right now, so no one... Yep, there it is. So that's pretty much it. Uh, at this point, HLSW is properly configured and set up, and you can use it for monitoring your Gary's Mod server. Oh, another thing to, to mention is that you can add in as many servers as you like. So if I had you know, three or four servers that I was running at the time, I could type in another server in this box here, and it would populate another server in the drop-down list. You can have as many as you want, and then you just select which server you want. Each one has its own Archon password, and that's it. So thanks.